Hello YouTube, welcome to this video and it's another My Cancer Vlogs. Thank you so much for all the likes and comments and words of support you gave on last week's and in advance for the one you're going to do hopefully this week. RJ's had a good week. A little bit tired but a lot of things happened since I last spoke to you last Friday. Because it's Christmas Day tomorrow, the vlog's a day early, and Merry Christmas and Happy to New Year to each and every one of you. Tomorrow I've got my Christmas message, where I'll be explaining what I'm doing on Christmas Day, and that be in English and in German. Now getting back to the, the last seven, six days even. I was at my mum's over the last weekend. Saturday and Sunday I saw my family, my brothers, Daryl, his wife and their new child, Ethan. So that was fun. Went out to lunch as well and had a nice time. I saw my other sisters as well and their children. Monday I went back home and on Tuesday I saw my doctor who signed me off for another month and gave me some sleeping tablets. Tuesday afternoon I saw the new Star Wars film and I'm going to do a short review of that after I've given you a rundown of this week. Wednesday my mum came up again and on today I went to see my consultant, had a blood test, it's all coming back good. My consultant's pleased with me, my weight has stayed the same as three weeks ago. So I've had tiredness this week. I'm having an hour of sleep each day, plus seven at night, or eight hours at night. So I'm going to give myself eight and a half out of ten. I've had no other secondary side effects, so I'm happy. On Tuesday next week, I've got my chemo number three and I'll be back with an update on New Year's Day this work next week also. Here comes the Star Wars review and we'll be back with the afterword after in about four minutes. Okay guys, the film was fucking amazing. And what am I talking about? Star Wars, The Force Awakens. If you do one thing this year, or even the beginning of next, go and watch this film and give it a thumbs up. RJ thoroughly recommends it. As you can see, I'm modeling this t-shirt by Darth Vader. A big thank you to Tom who sent it to me as a present. And that's Tom Sig Reviews from Germany and thank you Tom again for being a friend and for helping me with my German okay The Force Awakens I'm not going to give it the plot away but I'll tell you a little bit about it over the next couple of minutes if you don't like Star Wars this won't last too long it's the seventh of the series the series started off in 1977 with A New Hope in 1980 Empire Strikes Back, then Return of the Jedi in 83. This one, The Force Awakens, is set after the Return of the Jedi. Then you did the prequels. That's in 99, The Phantom Menace, Attack of the Clones in 2002, and Revenge of the Sith in 2005. I've uh, the first three of this 
that's New Hope, Empire Strikes Back, and Return of the Jedi, to the ones he made later. This time, J.J. Abrahams directs it, and the stars of the film are Daisy Ridley, John Boyega, and Oscar Isaac, with returning stars Harrison Ford, Carrie Fort Fisher, and Mark Hamill. Okay, he opens the classic Star Wars way with the scroll going up into the screen. It's in 3D and it's fucking amazing 3D. And it basically says the disappearance of Luke Skywalker, the Republic sends one of their most trusted pilots to try and find him or a bit the map. There's a rise of the dreadful first order, that's Darth Vader and the dark side, etc. And they're looking for the map of St. Luke's whereabouts. A stormtrooper called Finn was dis disgusted by the genocide in the Republic and he flits with Ray as desert scavenger to form an alliance and be a good guy. All your old favourites are in there. Harrison Ford, Chewbacca, Carrie Fisher, R2-D2, C-3PO, etc, etc. A special mention goes to a character called Max Canete, who's a barfly with glasses. She makes the film tick. 135 minutes, the battle scenes and are not over the top, just awesomely staged. I know it's computer generated, but unlike the last three films, believable. 11 out of 10, RJ recommends it. It's out of this world. Back to my blog about cancer. Straight after this. Okay, welcome back. I hope you enjoyed that segment of the vlog. Now, my thank yous. First of all, thank you goes to Cigar Hub, because that's Chris from Scotland, for the cigar pre presents he sent me in the post. If you unsubscribe to his channel, links down below. Cigar Hub. Also, to my unboxing video which I made yesterday and thank you so much Chris and I hope you enjoy the cigars I sent you. Second thank you goes to Tom from Munich. Yep, Tom Sick Reviews, you probably know him from last year. I met up with him in Munich. Also he sent me a Star Wars t-shirt and I'm wearing that t-shirt when I gave his shirt out on Monday to Same Seed Reviews and NY Italio Mario is back. And that video is in the description if you want to look at the t-shirt. Sorry, it's packed in my suitcase in the other room. And because it's Christmas Eve, I wanted to make this video quickly. Also, to for the continued support from my, all my online friends, Paul, Thanks again for that amazing book and I'm a lighter and I'll be making more from the book in 2016. Also from Johan, Josh and Lucy, my sister and I'm trying to and I'm sorry if I've left your name out but RJ's getting forgetful. I forgot to mention that as a side effect of chemotherapy. Or is it old age? I don't know. My dick's still there. It's still working. I've still got my hair. And once again, I've had a good week. I gave myself 8.5 out of 10. So I'm happy. Next week, in the next seven days, 
this is what you're going to do, see on my channel tomorrow Christmas Day Merry Christmas once again to all my subscribers you're going to see a Christmas Day message in English and in German on Sunday you're going to see the news review of the year in English and in German on Tuesday is part one of my good times and bad times of 2015 video my highs and lows of the year and part one is my good times on Thursday that's New Year's Eve is my bad times video of 2015 part two of the good my good times and bad times obviously there's only one bad time which has been this event which happened on the 23rd of September where I got went into hospital but it's Christmas I'm not going to dwell on that my weight stayed the same as I said and I'm going to eat loads of stuff over Christmas and hopefully put on a kilo in weight Thank you again to every one of you that supports me with messages, comments and liking these videos. It means so much to me. I'm not alone. I'm staying strong and I will beat cancer. These weekly vlogs will continue until further notice. And the next one will be on New Year's Day. It's only a day early because of Christmas Day this week. My whereabouts next week. Monday I go back to my house. Tuesday I go for chemo. Then I'm coming back to this house, my mum's, for New Year's Eve and New Year's Day. So this is where I'll be with next week's video. Have a great Christmas. Merry Christmas to you. Happy New Year. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for your message support. Thanks for liking and giving this video a thumbs up. Also, thumbs up to you, Johan, the Church of Cigar, the Cigar Hub, all my quality awesome friends who make amazing videos they're all going to get a mention tomorrow in tomorrow's Christmas Day message and you've seen them with previously recommended etc etc check out Chris down below and stay lit guys and thanks for watching and I'm so looking forward to Christmas and I'm going to tell you all about it in tomorrow's video. Stay lit guys.